What? Smoking all my dragons, divine, righteous, almighty, greats, overachieving, never slacking. So, whew, this is going to be hard for me to pronounce. Hell young, Lifa Krigsgalda. And this, <laughs> y'all probably laughing at me. Okay, so um, this is going to be, we taking it to Norse. You know, Norse, which uh, I love Norse history. I love Norse mythology. So that's really what attracted me to this video. I actually just tried to react to it. Here's the funny thing. As soon as I started reacting to it, right? Or as soon as I started watching it, the woman started blowing a horn and literally my laptop just, things just kind of fell. I'm like, woo, that's some powerful energy. But we're going to hop right into it right now and I'm going to do my best to give uh, my best take when it's all said and done. Here we go. Y'all see that? It didn't, it didn't, she didn't start blowing it this time, but let me just make sure I'm secure. We good to go? Okay. All right. So it's the effort. Give me a, give me a thumbs up for effort. Cause I'm working right now. Right. <laughs> so I'm working while I'm working. Got it. I'm, I'm stacking this on paper plates right now, but I got to get the job done. Right. Here we go. You have auto glass damage, trust safe light. This day. Okay, okay.
just needs to die for But you only understand the language of the soul What if I want to tell you to leave me and my pillows once in peace But you only understand the language of the soul I let the place be the talking So my tongue shall become iron My words the mighty roar of war Revealing my divine anger's arrows shall strike All action for the good of all I see my reflection in your eyes My new age has just begun So it is soft The fire of the furnace It hungers to be hit And wants to have a hundred sisters In the coldest state of their existence They may dance the maddest In the morris of the red rain We love brother enemy I sing my soul song for you The lullaby of obliteration So I can wake up with a smile Bliss in my heart And bliss in my heart Bliss in my heart Sisters, conflict, come back Infestation, regeneration, transformation That is the best I can do for you I see a great gloom on the horizon Promises of power for sun to rise No fire, no It will make the old fire Some purification, purification Look like dying ember 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 Let me let me first just say, right? They are conjuring up some some very strong. They got some very powerful energy because every day or every time I come to this specific client's house and I set this up this way, not once has it ever fell. Even I did reactions even prior to this video. Everything was cool. I kid you not. As soon as I started 
like on a, on a, on a reaction I tried before this one, the video I tried. As soon as I started to press play and she st and, the, and the horn started getting blown, I kid you not, stuff just started to fall back. So then I did this video. Y'all seen it was still kind of right before they started. It fell a little bit. And then just now I kind of had to get it right again. But it's set up just how it's usually always set up. You know, like, and it's never, that's never happened before. So I already know they got some powerful energy, especially they using, you know, they using them, the, the uh, what, nature and bones. And they, they just, man, it's refreshing to see that. It was definitely very beautiful. And it reminds me of, um, there's this actually this Native American artist I had reacted to, and he was real, like, I mean, dressed in his whole Native American attire, and uh, that's, it's just powerful energy. It's refreshing to see people still connected with with their culture, right? It says that uh, Krigsgalda, excuse my pronunciation again, my apologies, or War Chant in Old Norse is a song by the band Hell Young that speaks of the power and complexity of conflict and a struggle for understanding. The lyrics paint a vivid picture of a warrior mustering their courage and channeling that energy into a righteous rage as they take up arms against their enemies. The bridge of the song speaks to the futility of attempting peaceful communication with those who only understand the language of the sword, culminating in the singer choosing let the blade do the talking, so my tongue shall become iron. The chorus brings together the different themes of the song, balancing the battle readiness of the warrior with a longing for peace and understanding. I see a great gloom on the horizon that promises a powerful sun to rise. To melt away all moons, it will make the old fires of purification look like dying embers. Listen, at the end of the day, we already know when it comes to you know, the, in Norse Nature mythology, ain't a, a lot of our ancients, period, we already know they was a different type of warriors. Even when you look at that show right now, Shogun, uh, with the, I think they are the Japanese, and, and Shogun, the one that's viral right now. I, I watched, I watched like the first or second episode, and you see people literally getting, getting boiled alive, like just show their skin coming off. I mean, just different times. There was a lot more barbaric back then when it came to war. They did not play around. I don't care if you're talking about the Zulus in ancient Africa or the Mayans or the Aztecs or it just all around the world, all the tribes in the, that we've never heard of, right? The Vikings, like all these different tribes, they were a lot, there was, there was, there was a different ball game back then. Um, and <laughs> when I look at this video, and I and, and I look at this, it's like, and, and you hear this warrior pretty much saying, you know, it, his response to peace is pretty much war with everything. That's the mindset they had. But I also feel like when I look at it from, I say, like an esoteric point of view, um, I feel like that's why so many people go through hell today, too, because maybe in past lives, you know, there was these barbar all this barbaric stuff that was going on. Maybe people are paying for it now. Maybe they're coming back again and they're paying for it being, you know, when you hear about people getting into horrible accidents or just crazy stuff happening and you're like, damn, they went out like that? That was unexpected. Maybe they're paying for something in a past life where they were barbaric and didn't want to, to up that vibration to something that was more fitting to Mother Earth. Uh, so yeah, I, I can see that. I can see that. But that was, that was beautiful. A lot of culture, just amazing. Love the paintings. I mean, it's, it's, it's beautiful. I love it. I love it. And that throughout history, especially when you go look at the, uh, the Vikings TV show with Ragnar and you, you see that the war that they had was against, you know, the church against England and, you know, they, they were being called, um, pagans and beasts and just demonized constantly. So, um, I love to see people still represent their culture. You know, a lot of people love to say, you know, oh, Europe didn't have culture, but no, they had, they had a lot of culture. They was just, they was demonized. They had their fights over there. You know, they had their fights over there. You see it all through the Vikings. You see it all through, they, they had their fights. So let's not be ignorant. You know, let's not be ignorant. You know, I think we all, I think, I think if we all really sit down and come together and talk, and I'm not just saying, I'm not talking to hold hands. No, I'm just saying if we all like study each other, we'll realize there's a lot of similarities. 
We've all been crossed. I'm talking I'm talking everybody from different ethnicities and just different cultures. We've all been crossed by our own kind. We've all went through some form of oppression. You know, I mean, but if we really, I feel like if we really trace it back, we'll start to realize that everything kind of comes from somewhere, right? That we're all kind of pulling from. It's like we're all on this Wi-Fi connection and we're all connected to it, but we don't realize it. And this is why you can see so much traditions being so similar in the older days. So similar on different way, different all different parts of the planet, but they're dissimilar, right? Because they're all tapping into something, right, that connects us all. That's what I'm trying to say. And I think that's beautiful. But with that being said, original link in the description, and I'll be back with more love. If you like this, I said, I said I'll be back with more love. I guess that was just my heart talking. Really, what I meant to say was I'll be back with more videos soon. If you enjoyed this video, you know, don't be afraid to hit that like, that subscribe, that notification bell. I also am an affiliate now. So if you wear anything like say champion, you know, I will tag it and have it pop up. So just click the link and you doing that, that, that helps out this channel. That helps to support this channel a lot. And I definitely appreciate it, you know, but with that being said, everybody enjoy your day. Much love.